Hey y'all, this is Anna Alexander. Welcome back to the basement as I'm trying to squeeze in a quick episode of Has Been Hotel. This is season one, episode six. And for all y'alls who work in accounting and it's month end, you know what I mean by squeezing in. We're squeezing, but, but, okay. So we met Pops and dad wasn't exactly what I was expecting. I didn't think he would, I didn't think Lucifer would be evil or have that sinister-ish look like um, Alistair or Vox, or is it Kestriel, Kestiel, Kestiel. But I, I was hoping Lucifer would have a wee bit of an edge. We saw like half a second of edge, but I didn't expect him to be such a goofball. <laughs> Unexpected, yeah, uh -huh. but he's gonna get Charlie at least an appointment to go to heaven so she can plead her case about Saving souls. Will it be successful? Who knows? Oh, speaking of, okay. So Alistair himself is chained to somebody. Fascinating, but I'm excited to get to it. And I'm so glad that you're all here with me for this adventure. You have been making it so much fun. And yes, I'm gonna get to hell of a boss soon. Sunday, plan it on Sunday. But okay, you're gonna get your blanket check whatever beverage check a uh, full episode watch along is available on patreon i would love to see you there and if you're ready i'm ready let's get to it okay i have my warm weather clothes and my cold weather clothes i have a light jacket flat jacket and rain jacket wait does it rain in heaven yeah what is the the terrain in heaven not clouds <laughs> i take it then i wish i could come sweetie but i have that thing what thing God, I'm such a bad liar. So Baggy's not in heaven, or in hell, I should say, because of lying then. <laughs> you look messy. What happened to you? It's who happened to me. And the answer is everyone. Twice. <laughs> what up, boys? <laughs> oh, cherry bomb. <laughs> Here, hold this. <gasps> oh, my God. Oh, my God. Nope, give me that. I love seeing you, Jerry. But I'm too tired. I need to pass out. Oh, you can sleep when you're double dead, fuckhead. Come on, what you really need is a recharge. Oh, that is kind of an odd thought, isn't it? <laughs> sleep when you're dead, unless you're in hell. <laughs> There's no sleeping in hell. It's so nice to meet one of Angel's friends. He never brings anyone around. I wonder why. Yeah, me too. Whew. Yeah, hi. Angel and his friend are taking you all out for a night of fun and relaxation. Wait, I am only here for and Ooh, never. Okay, Charlie. <laughs> From where? Anyway, the portal to heaven should be opening right about. <gasps> <No>! <gasps> <gasps> Wait, did she just throw Baggy through the portal? Well, if it isn't my arch nemesis. Oh, yeah. Place. She didn't bring any of her bags. <laughs> oh, uh, 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 Charlie, Morningstar. Hmm, Chai, I'm not seeing you on my list here. Try okay. Lucifer, Morningstar. Oh, fuck! <laughs> St. Peter, we can take it from here. What is the, oh, what was that? I'm Sarah, the high Sarah from heaven. You're gifted to be here. Hi! I'm Emily. You are gifted to be here. Welcome to heaven. Oh, where the virtuous reside 24-7. Oh, people are happy that they die. And if you notice, I figured out a feature on my editing program so I can edit these songs a wee bit better to avoid, you know. And everyone is Even the, even the animals are hot. When you see our realm, you'll never want to go back down. Of course it is just <laughs> It's not safe. Welcome to heaven. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Holy f***ing shitballs. Am I you want to start a fight on the promenade in front of everyone? Better than waiting for the fucking extermination. Shh, sir. What was the Seraphim's one rule? Uh, no one but the exorcist can know about the exterminations. I know, fine. Oh. 
Oh. What are the Hellspawn doing here? Well, you failed to control the demon's unrest, and now Lucifer is involved. Look, I never would have agreed to your yearly activities if I thought it would bring trouble to our doorstep. Keeping heaven safe was my only reason for allowing it. Safe? Oh. I want you to do whatever you need to do to keep this problem from getting any worse. So they think hell's going to be so overrun that they'll come up to heaven anyway but how zoo where all the animals are actually soft you coming uh i need a break but hug a koala for me omg can you imagine an actual koala ah, see you later <laughs> hey there vagasaurus i'm looking for you why do you really think i wouldn't recognize one of my top girls just because you're out of uniform <laughs> You are on the front lines. I wouldn't forget a bad bitch like you. It's why I named you after the best thing ever. What? Anyway, you sure f***ed up, didn't you? Wait. What? Run now. Someone as worthless as you landed Lilith's little hottie. Their love is vile and blasphemous. Hot as fuck, though. I'm sorry. <laughs> you work for me again, and at the hearing, you're gonna help me shut this kindergarten snowflake bullshit down for good. So Lucifer isn't the only fallen angel? I'm sure your relationship will be fine. See you in court. Wow! Oh no, not him again. Oh, yeah, baby. Saw that you went to my manager. <laughs> <laughs> Webster's dictionary defines redemption as Objection! Lame and unoriginal. Sustained. Sustained. <laughs> what do you think it takes to get into heaven? Um uh, well, uh... Is everything okay, Adam? Nope. Act selfless, don't steal, stick it to the man. Are you f***ing serious? Sure got me here, didn't it? <laughs> right, Sarah? Yeah, what did get him there? Well, I bet Angel is doing all of those things right now. Then let's f***ing see it, bruh. Oh, isn't this place the f***ing best? I'll admit consent is a good name for a sex club. It is a good name for a sex club. Miss Bomb, I, I'd like to buy you a drink. Why? Didn't you say we're arch rivals? Uh, um, because I'm buying everyone a drink. Three drinks and one alcohol! You know, Val, he's into this waterboarding shit now. I, I don't know, it's a kink. I don't, I don't think it's a kink. Here, take one of these and you won't be worrying about nothing. You want to fuck up all your progress? Be my guest. I just thought you were better than that. I don't know. It's been a long night, and I don't need to go too wild. <laughs> Chetty, I bought you a shot. Because I bought everyone another shot! Hooray! Let's do it! Are you really telling me you've never had a drink with friends at the end of a hard day? Uh, we don't have hard days? In heaven. <laughs> We'll make good decisions. Come on, we have to keep watching. Is is Charlie banking on the fact that um Angel can be redeemed like at that? Um, like, oh yeah, he's redeemable. Boom and stick suck him up. Round twelve, motherfucker. <laughs> Soaking wet and oh shit, where'd you go? <gasps> Please, damn it! Stop! You can't take that! God, Nymph, why are you being such a mess? I'm the mess! Oh no! <gasps> oh no! Oh, that is an idea. Hey, Stu! <laughs> the club has a sex room. <gasps> wow! Not that they have a sex room, but that Pinchas is gonna try a shot with Jerry. 
a sex. Why would we have sex? Ah, ah, because I'm having sex with everyone here. The hotel isn't a problem in his life. It's uh, Valentino. <gasps> Is Valentino there? You're gorgeous. Do you need a job? Okay, come yeah, on. a star. Where's Born Nifty? Star. Jeez. Uh, drink or I'll fucking kill you. <laughs> I said I'll fuck. Oh, bad boy. <laughs> Who's this chiquita? You're bringing me fresh meat. <laughs> Oi! Fell. Excuse me? I said fuck off. I may have to put up with your bullshit, but you ain't f***ing with any of my friends. You, I own you, bitch. In the studio. So I'm taking that. That's why Angel was so quick to move out. <gasps> it was worth it. Ooh. D, he did everything on your checklist. Uh, well, uh, then why isn't he here then? Yeah, why isn't he here? Oh, the the child is gonna gonna None speak. Of you know what gets someone into heaven? This questioning stops now. <laughs> that answer then would be no. We know when a soul arrives. We know when a soul arrives. But she was right, Sarah. Now we turn our backs, no second glance. It's not as simple as you think. It's not fair, Sarah. I'm sure you wish it could be so. But there's a lot that you don't know. Like what? He blew his shot like the fox in his mouth. This discussion is Adam. Gotta say, I can't wait to Adam. come down and exterminate you. What are you saying? Let me get this straight. You go down there and kill those poor you souls. You didn't know. What? So oh. tell me that you didn't know. It's my load to shoulder. No. You have to listen. It was such a hard decision. I wanted to say <laughs> everything's being spilled. <laughs> I feel like my mouth is permanently. Well, I don't need your condescension. I'm not a child, too. Oh, good to know. Okay, thank you. Was I too naive to expect you to heed the morals you're purveying? That's what the fuck I've been saying. <laughs> if hell is forever, then heaven must be a lie. I was told not to trust in angels. By her? <laughs> she should know. Oh, here goes. Why hide the fact that you're an angel just like us? But... But wouldn't Vaggy then been showing that they are that redeemed herself? So her hair is really her wings. Was that it? But this court finds that there is no evidence souls in hell can be redeemed. What? You better save the date, cunts, because we're coming to your hotel first. Don't give up on this. I'll figure something out. I promise. So what happens if angels are killed? can I bring joy when I now know we are bringing misery to thousands of innocent people? If you start to question, you could end up like Lucifer, fallen. I'm sorry. Ah, oh, so many questions. Well, that was a humdinger of an episode. I have so many. I have questions and I don't have questions. So who do the angels answer to? Is it, is it God? And God is like all knowing. So God would be cool with this, would have to know what Adam was up to. Right? Is it cool? And what happens if an angel dies? Like the angel went down and Camilla, who I want to see again, kills an angel. Do they just like a demon who's slayed by an angel would just go. Or does it have to be a demon overlord that kills an angel for them to be permanently. Yeah. And with Baggy being a fallen angel, her, the reason she is a fallen angel is because she saw the error of what she was doing, I would think would be relatable to Charlie as an, oh, you were trying to do better and by doing better made you end up in hell. That was some, I did not see coming. 
<laughs> I get so delighted when something honestly just surprises me. Oh, I'm so happy. <laughs> Whenever I see somebody who I want stricken, stricken from a show, I always say, who gets Humperdinck? So Adam, if we ever lose Adam, who gets Humperdinck? He needs to go seriously. Oh, I'm so excited for the next episodes, but I'm also sad because there's only two more left and I don't know how long it will be till season two. And yes, there's he hell of a boss, but it won't be quite the same. Oh, 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 okay. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, so um, until the next episode when I can squeeze another one, please take care of yourselves, stretch your bodies. Um, right now in my real time, it's, it's leap year. So happy leap year. I hope you light a candle, make a wish, have some ice cream, whatever makes you happy and welcome to spring soon, almost. Um, so yes, um, take a second to breathe, uh, go get some toast and then come back and watch the next episode in the queue. So thanks again, you all, and until next time.